the Chief Justice of Bangladesh has been apparently asked to go on a leave after he scrapped a major amendment to the Constitution of Bangladesh. The case has sparked a major debate in the country, with lawyers and opposition parties launching an attack against the Sheikh Hasina government. Vyond's Saad Hamadi brings you this report. Bangladesh Chief Justice Surendra Kumar Sinha is allegedly facing the ire of the country's government. Sinha has been at the receiving end of a massive criticism campaign after his scathing observations against the 16th Amendment of the Constitution. Justice Sinha wants to go to Australia but is believed to be confined as he awaits permission to leave the country. Behind me is the Bongo Bhavan, the residence of the President of Bangladesh, President Abdul Hamid. The law ministry in Bangladesh has forwarded a letter from the Supreme Court administration seeking the President's assent for a leave that Chief Justice S. Kasina has sought to travel to Australia for about a month beginning October 13 and up to November 10. But this leave has come after a major pressure that has been exerted on him, according to some lawyers as well as politicians. After a verdict, he has delivered a historic verdict in August, which has, imp uh, which has scrapped the power of the parliament to impeach judges for any misconduct. We've heard that you are in Australia, sir. We all managed to speak to Justice Sinha. Uh, I am not in Australia. I'm in Bangladesh right now. Right. Uh, I, I, if, I, if I get my permission of the government, that is Honorable President, then I will go to Australia. I have obtained visa for Australia, uh, but but uh, I, till now I can't tell you right now because I did not receive the government. The row is over the 16th Amendment to the Bangladesh Constitution, which was declared illegal by Justice S.K. Sinha. The amendment gave Parliament the power to impeach the judges of the country's apex court. Are going to go for us to Australia. Under pressure, Justice Sinha refrained from revealing much in the conversation with Vion. I sorry, I, I will not give any reply. I will not give any interview to the press. Please, please for this is my, my, my country because I am the Chief Justice. I want my, my country first. My judicial independence, our judiciary is very strong. The government, however, denies any charge of pressure tactics. Mr. Suna is the Chief Justice of Bangladesh and he can take his own leave by himself. And he's not, to, he's not supposed to take leave from the Honorable President or anybody else. He has just informed the Honorable President that he's going, he needs some rest, he's going, being sick and he has been suffering from various diseases including cancer for many days and it is known to everybody. A proven fact needs, need not to be proved. But lawyers and opposition parties paint a different picture. Our Chief Justice uh, is a uh, member of a minority committee, so he uh, wants something against our uh, national spirit. Like that, they are talking uh, in many forums. By this act, we feel that the judiciary will not be independent and the government will interfere each and every stage. That is, the, that is our anxiety in this country. He has taken the visa not for his own will. And there are some pressure. And the people's, the powerful peoples are trying to turn him out from this country. Justice Eskasena has refused to speak to the media, but we have gathered that Justice Eskasena may be leaving the country, going to Australia on Friday, the 13th of October this month. That is the update so far that we have gathered. There's been a security cordon across his house, and he's being restricted, as we have been told. We've tried to seek permission to get inside his residence to speak to him, but the police uh, personnel deployed in front of his house have told us that there is no permission or access granted for the press to visit him or go inside the premises. In Dhaka, in front of the Chief Justice's residence, Sadhamadi, we are.